Welcome to The Late Show. I'm your host, Stephen Colbert. Happy Friday, everybody. It's got that Friday vibe. It's got that Friday vibe, John. It's not happy for government workers, though. Workers who today missed their second consecutive paycheck. Things have gotten so bad that the IRS has added a new question to the tax form. Would you like $3 of your federal tax to go to buying us a sandwich? <laughs> It's the longest shutdown in U.S. history, and we should have seen this coming because, according to White House officials, after Trump made the decision, there was no game plan for what to do next. That's leadership. Okay, guys, huddle up. Come on, huddle up. Bring it in. Let's huddle up. Okay. <laughs> Does anyone know how to play football? because I have no idea what I'm doing. I have no idea. Who that? There's one government employee who's clearly not essential. White House press secretary and grown-up honey boo-boo Sarah Huckabee Sanders. Even though press briefings are traditionally held every day, Huckabee Sanders has not provided an on-camera briefing for more than a month. That's right. It's been a month since we've gotten no information. <laughs> Hugga Sands told her Fox and Friends friends that it's not a big deal. Look, I take questions from reporters every single day. I've done over 100 briefings, answered thousands of questions from members of the press. I stopped last night after I finished an interview where I took questions mm -hmm. and took more questions from a gaggle of reporters. Uh, the questions never stop. Even when I look in the mirror, it's Sarah, how do you live with yourself? And... <laughs> Sarah, how can you ever explain this to your children, your grandchildren? And, and Sarah, and Sarah, will, will people believe it if your resume says 2016, 2019, work to Quiznos? <laughs> but don't worry, Huckus Sands will be back soon, at least according to White House spokesman Hogan Gidley. We came to expect those, those afternoon briefings, press briefings from the White House uh, every day almost. There has not been one held this year, Hogan. Is there any plans to start that back up again or see Sarah oh, Sanders back up at the podium? <laughs> she, she's going to come back when she uh, finds uh, a reason to do that. Sarah Sanders will absolutely be back at this podium talking to the press and, and delivering the message to the American people. But no definitive date on that. I'm sorry? No definitive date yet on that beginning. Uh, oh, no, it's, it, it's not that they've ever stopped. Yeah. <laughs> Just because they're not happening doesn't mean the press briefings ever stop. It's just that they're not happening anymore. It's just, it's, 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 it's like we're not dead. We're just not going to waste time with that breathing thing anymore. <laughs> waste of time. But I have to be honest, I missed a lot of what that guy said just now because his name is Hogan Gidley. <laughs> I think he's the Hogwarts student who got picked last for Quidditch. Gidley always drops the quaffle. <laughs> or quaffle always drops the Gidley. I don't know, sure. And his name is just the tip of the Gidleyberg. <laughs> Though that is the most sensitive part of the Gidleyberg. <laughs> because if you jump on Hogan's Twitter, you'll find a gallery of jacked Hogan Gidley shots <laughs> where he's holding dead possums that he just shot with a handgun. Ah, yes, the possum. The most dangerous and elusive of prey. <laughs> they play dead, Hogan. <laughs> They're meeting you halfway. <laughs> oh, dead? Oh, should I kill myself or do you wanna? That's not. That's, that's not. That's cool. not hunting. That's a mob execution. <laughs> yeah, you ratted us out, possum. Sleep with the otters. <laughs> now let's go whack a hibernating fox. <laughs> also, in every photograph, Gidley is really showing off that belt buckle. <laughs> Ladies, if your man can't turn his belt into a grappling hook and swing you to safety, you aren't dating Hogan Gidley. <laughs> can we, Jim, can we look at that again? Look at that thing. It's got like a latch and a brass handle. It's like, a, it's like an airplane safety door handle right there. <laughs> He's got to keep it cranked closed so his pants don't depressurize mid-flight, and then it's... It's just goodbye, Gidley bits. Just sucked out the the Gidley bits. 